Seems I'm not the only one out fishing today. That is a bloody big cormorant. That's the size of him. Good morning. Uh, I'm back on the Avon again. On an incredibly sunny day. It's supposed to be about minus five today. Um, it's actually surprisingly warm in the sunshine. Um, I've decided to start at the lock um, just because it gives it a really easy place to set up and I had those two runs last time. Unfortunately, nothing's happened so far this morning. Uh, I've probably been fishing for about 20 minutes. So yeah, I've got a herring, half a herring out on the float and I've got half a mackerel tail on the ledger. And I've cast them both a couple of times, kind of every 10 minutes or so. So yeah, I've got one, I've got my um, sprat twitching rods set up, so I'm going to do that. And then I think I'm going to hoof along the bank, try somewhere a little bit further upstream. The water level's way back down again, it was apparently five metres up on what it was before. Uh, my last session, so um, yeah, I'm really glad it's down. So yeah, I'm not sure if conditions are perfect. I mean, it's it's been cold and it's been sunny, so who knows? I prefer it if it's kind of overcast. Um, there's a little less colour in the water, but hey. So, yeah, I think another five minutes here while I set the other rod up, and then it'll be time to hoof. Well, I was not expecting that. Hudson Swan, I literally cast out two minutes ago and had some swans come and visit me. And how about that? I thought the swans had actually run into the line. Turned out to be a pike. Beautiful. Happy days. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. It's getting back. Love it. Well, I was not expecting that. That was bonkers. I literally, I ran down here from the lock. It's a bit of a hike. Um, but she was another YouTube channel called Effort Equals Success. This is a shining example of that effort did equal success. Um, yeah, I literally just flicked the rock next to a tree. That was the major way. I balled up some of my uh, bread mix and stuff and dropped it in. Right now, my head is being done in by swans, and this lot have found, I think, the mackerel tail that came off when I just caught that pike. I can't cast a rod in the water with them out, just absolutely attacking it right now. I'm hoping they'll just go down the bank with that now and leave me alone. Um, yeah, all of a sudden. Rod tip starts going, and I'm thinking, oh, that's bloody swans, really annoying. I was just sorting out the cameras. And off it went! Amazing! So, yeah, yet again, five minutes in the right place versus half an hour in the wrong place. So I fourth swim in and uh, I'm not getting, I'm not tapping nothing at the moment. It's, yeah, it's really, really difficult. Ah, well that's a really frustrating end to the session, unfortunately. Um, I couldn't get into the swim that I wanted, there were guys working on the pontoons opposite making a hell of a noise. Um, so I jumped into this swim and I've just been snagged up and I've managed to pull it free and then a huge red block of polystyrene went through and just wiped me out and uh, yeah, a bit of a frustrating end to the day really uh, and I've just been mobbed by the swans again. <laughs> so 
yeah, it was nice to have that fish earlier on and it's been beautiful to be out on the bank. It's been a really nice day today. But I think I'm gonna call it a day, pack down, go and pick up the kids. It's a shame not to have had another one, but hey, it's always a shame not to have another one. So yeah, hope you enjoyed that. Sorry if there was no monsters like there were last time, but you know, you gotta try. So yeah, and this is the first video I've shot mainly on my DSLR, so I'm interested to see how the footage looks when we go. Anyway, like the video if you did, subscribe if you haven't, I'll see you next time. Cheers.